You can run out of gas, fuel, you can run out of food, your uh, refrigeration could go down and, and your food could spoil, your food may not arrive, the supply line might be broken, so then you've got to resort back to your ration packs. So there's a lot of different variations and uh, factors that can impact in the field. The other really interesting piece of equipment here is the chuffer. See that you put a, little, put a little bit of petrol in there like that and you light it up and then you preheat it so you get a draft going and it warms it up a bit, drips the fuel through and hits the plate yeah. and then once it hits the plate and it's hot mm. it sort of makes a chuff, chuff sound. But what I've tried to do here is get a variety of the plates throughout the ages but I haven't really got a complete set of everything yet so I'm sort of bits and pieces missing. It was used even like up to the mid 70s. In 1976 that was, was the last time I ever saw it used and I sort of I was coming back off leave and I sort of regret not using, having used it. It's wood fired or coal fired. Mm. It's steam operated and then what happens is you actually have to pump it up. It was quite a good bit of kit.